quick clip here of what I poured today. It's coconut lime verbena, and oh my gosh, I've never soaked with it, but it does. It smells really good. I used coconut cream with the lye solution, and all my, because it did thicken up on me, and I tried doing the column swirl, but it did thicken up. Um, when I don't want it to get thick, it does, and when I want it to get thick, it doesn't, but I'm finally keeping good notes of what colorants affect it. I definitely know that using coconut milk um, makes the batch thicken up, so um, I will definitely use it in the future if I want to like do some really good texturing and piping on the top. But look how pretty it came out. I think the colors, there's green in the middle. I didn't have a lot of green left to do the tops. But this is just a, a quick clip to kind of show you what I've been doing. The tutorial um, will be online soon. And you be sure to um, view the unmolding of these just to see what they turned out like. They'll be available on DesertMoonBathAndBody.com. The link is listed below if you want to try it. Very skin nourishing. Um, I don't skimp when it comes to the oils. I use very high quality oils. Almond oil, palm oil, coconut oil, sustainable palm oil. Um... Oh, did I say almond oil? Castor oil. I don't use the, the Walmart vegetables 